Welcome to clickmeproject.com Let us see the demo of an anthology based approach to text summarization. Extractive text summarization aims to create the condensed version of one or more source documents by selecting most informative sentence. Research in text summarization has therefore often focused on measures of the usefulness of sentences for a summary. We present an approach to sentence extraction that maps sentence to nodes of hierarchical anthology. By considering anthology attributes, we are able to improve the semantic representation of sentence information content. The classifier that maps sentences to Taxonomy is trained using search engines and is therefore very flexible and not bound to specific domain. We present an approach to sentence extraction that maps sentence to nodes of hierarchical ontology. By considering ontology attributes, we are able to improve the semantic representation of sentence information content. The classifier that maps the sentence to taxonomy is trained using search engines and is therefore very flexible and not bound to specific domain. DBPDI is one of the most successful examples of LD technology and is especially well suited for enriching educational contents because of its quality as anthology but also because of size and quality of its content. On the one side, DBPDI represented in OWL that is ontology web language and uh, structured through well-known set of vocabularies and classifications is an active ontology that is constantly being improved to reach higher quality levels this feature is very important since the effectiveness of traditional sentiment analysis approach depends directly on the quality of the anthology selected to annotate the documents. There is a list of modules in this process. First of all, data collection. In this module, initial date document corpus is selected. Second module is reprocessing. In this module, we have performed the removing stop boots and stemming process. After anthology construction, we are getting features from this pre-processing we are constructing the anthology after that we are getting the refined graph solution using threshold value calculated from the initial anthology finally we have getting the summarized form of text this process starts with document corpus selection after selecting the data, we have performed the pre-processing. Uh, after pre-processing, we have calculated the similarity between uh, documents. Uh, by using calculating the similarity, we have performed the document clustering. After clustering the data, we have selecting the cluster for creating the anthology. After selecting the cluster, we have calculated the frequency of terms in the cluster. After calculating the frequency, we have constructed the anthology and refining the anthology. Finally, we have getting the summarized text form. Let us see the demo of anthology based text summarization. First of all, we select the original data set. The data set collected from the Wikipedia article. After selecting the data set, we can remove the stop words. After that, we have to perform the stemming process. After performing the stemming, we have to calculate the term frequency for each term 
in each document. This is the term frequency for each term. After calculating the term frequency, we have calculating the inverse document frequency for document and the terms. After that, we have to calculate the TF star idea. After that, we have calculate the cosine similarity between TF star idea and the idea value. After that, we have to find out the cluster. There are four clusters are formed. After that, we have to calculate the frequency for cluster. This is the most frequent item technology. After calculating the frequency, we have constructing the initial ontology, that is initial graph solution. Ontology is created, then call the exe. After generating the initial graph solution, we have set the depth limit. This is the depth limit 1, this is depth limit 2, this is depth limit 3. We have set the threshold value. This is the depth threshold value. Next we have getting the refined graph solution. This is the refined graph solution. After that, we have to summarize the text. This is the summarized form of initial document corpus. This is the ranking for each keyword. Thank you. Thank you.